Uh, so today we will discuss very interesting trading prices running in an uptrend or downtrend. So at that time, awesome. so very interesting. And even I'm I'm uh, waiting for that strategy in specific stocks and indices. As I said uh, earlier, that uh, okay, just a minute. Now in Reliance, I'm applying this trading strategy. All right, uh, so somewhere uh, this is a, a supporting line right now in Reliance. Now first thing to uh, moving ever each chart we have seen price of bouncing of uh, moving average 20. Have you seen it? Is it clear? All right. So let me do in this market. So little more summary about that. And I wanna buy this uh, uh, Reliance. I wanna invest in Reliance. All right. Now, what behavior we have seen? Now we have Reliance is respecting moving average 20. They are bouncing off moving average 20. Now you can see they are high, higher high, higher low, and they're creating higher high. Now we are expecting gradually read. To this moving uh, so what I am now I sold put option here I sold put PE remember put option P means put option and strike price 16 I sold put option right when price will drop and right now you can see uh, I think premium something they are running. Let me check it what premium is running right now. Uh, here you can see premium 1600. Yeah, and this one 36. I have seen this 36. Have you seen it? Let me zoom a little more. Uh, 36 premium right now running means here I saw. Uh, put option, and I'm expecting that uh, reach that level. Uh, 30 days uh, and will be zero. I'm not expecting to drop from this level. So we are. I'm expecting uh, price will stay, and they will from this area. So once it the all premium let's show you 36 uh, 36 into 50 so i'll collect 1800 18000 this premium i invest 18000 <clears throat> let me see. now i think uh voice is okay now yeah Okay. All right. Uh, can you hear me? Hear me? Voice. Is it breaking again, right? Voice. Can you hear me still? Persist. Okay. Now? No issue. Okay. Voice. All right. All right. Okay. Thanks. Thanks. So I'll collect this premium. Okay. And I invest here. Okay. Uh, because uh, I hold my position for like 15 days, uh, one month. All right. Like that. So that is why I'm using daily chart or H1 chart. Okay, now when price will retrace to this level, I'll collect the all premium I invest in Reliance. Right, or you can say free. All right, if price goes up, so it's okay. I'll collect the premium only, enter. Uh, I don't wanna invest at that time. I, I have already. Okay, now 
question is that when price will retrace to this level, then what trading strategy again? I'm so in this class, I'll show you when price are running in an uptrend, how to trade by using option. All right. So means we are expect bouncing of moving average 20, 20 again we are expecting they will create a new high after retirement. So at that time we will apply different trading strategy in option. So today I gonna explain what trading strategy we gonna apply when trend is running clear uptrend or clear downtrend. So I think everybody knows, right? Where, uh, how to identify the trend. Okay. So even in my uh, course, uh, I already explained how to identify trend. Now here, perfect. And I, say, uh, I think everybody knows what pattern up. This is perfect engulfing pattern. In my class, I already explained five most powerful candlestick pattern. This one, bullish uh, engulfing pattern. Have you seen price goes up, retrace and form engulfing pattern. And finally, when they broke this area, so we are applying this. So similarly, when price will retrace, they will form some a bullish candlestick pattern. No, I'm not talking right now bullish engulfing. Any type of five most powerful candlestick pattern when they will appear in this area so i'll use different option trading strategy i told you right i never trade in stock uh, like i never uh, i'm not a swing trader in stock i'm a swing trader in option and big uh, big uh, swing trader and right with the trading in option even i never create any option video in my YouTube channel. Again, I don't have time that much to create that one, right? So I'm not focusing on YouTube. Actually, I'm managing my account. So yeah, luckily I to give you. All right, so whatever. Okay, let's see what trading strategy we're gonna apply. Let's see here. And let me tell you one thing, another here. Uh, who pe uh, people are applying in Various type of trading strategy Nifty right now 10,500 is very strong resistance. Why? Let me tell you. Okay, so let's understand. All right. So yesterday I told uh, somewhere here, not exactly somewhere here. So let's check it uh, daily chart. In daily chart yesterday I told that market close somewhere here in that moving average and we place a two giant like that trading strategy all right trading strategy if price goes up all right price goes up we will profitable price uh retrace uh, if price uh, giving a correction uh will profitable now today you can see uh know who is that they retrace so it will let continue at that time we we uh created uh, option trading strategy in any direction when price goes any direction will be a uh, profitable as goes up i'm profitable all right i told you yesterday so that is why we are creating this type of strategy so let me show you why is it very strong and uh, right now here you can see exactly price number is 200 I drone it. All right. Next, if you now see here, we 150 exponential moving average. And if you want to connect these two points, there here you can see 60 retracement. Yeah, exactly. Two sir. There, uh, there are 61 percent. So we are expecting that price may give a from from this area, but you can say. All right, we can say, but probability it may give a area. Okay, I'm not talking about that if, uh, from this area after doing this one, it will continue from this area. I hope we are expecting, or it is a probability 
to give a retracement from this area. So that is why we must construct or we must make option trading strategy in which direction price goes how will be a profitable okay let's see so let's uh, discuss uh, today trading strategy all right so whatever now see here uh, let's see uh, like that oh, listen carefully all right okay so right now price is too far from this area whatever okay when price is running in an uptrend clear uptrend or clear down then what exactly we are doing so let's see suppose price uh, not exactly this is uh, mm, 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 mm. this is nifty now we can't apply this strategy but let me explain okay it is i right there running like that we can't use that okay let me check it different stocks and uh, mm, i see i see a bank what are uptrend but let's see in nifty understand first okay now see nifty is supposed let me zoom a little more let's go to daily chart okay now i can see let me remove this one forget about that one so uh, okay now see nifty is running in uptrend high higher low higher high and the higher low and higher high and higher low. suppose they are creating higher high don't think this one high high but just or uh <laughs> they are creating uh higher low all right just think so in that case what exactly we are doing okay let me Okay, 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 okay. Kindly see the bank and Nifty also, sir. Okay, sure, sure, sure. Yeah, we'll discuss carefully what is the strategy we are applying, what is the profit and loss. All right. So forget about this one right now. Suppose price is running like that. All right. Okay, yeah, that will be good. Okay, now see how price is running getting higher high higher low higher high higher low and the higher high and this area i can say higher low let me see higher low so when they create a higher low what we are expecting means let's see price goes up retrace goes up retrace and retrace suppose somewhere here and now we are expecting price will go up to this yeah they will create a new high just we are expecting it is a probability all right they are bouncing off bouncing off bounce from this area and it will go to this level month uh, let's assume within a month price will goes to this level we are hoping all right we are expecting and we are analyzing by using different technical tools okay somewhere here somewhere here there is a resistance all right and somewhere here it is a support all right it may be moving average it may be horizontal support somewhere here right now at that time what exactly we are doing we are buying a specific uh uh what okay we are buying it at the money 
call we which is at the money or directly in the money not too far remember buying in the money most of the people are buying out the money but i prefer we are expecting pricing goes to this level and we, we are buying at the money here you can see at the money at that level okay let's see for your example for example okay all right let me remove this one okay all right let's see right now here price uh price is clear up trend and we are expecting price will go up to this level so let me make it a little more smaller okay so i'm not able to see this uh, what called price wait hold on hold on hold on yeah suppose we are expecting price will goes to the level of ten thousand let's say 800 or 900 10,800 okay let me edit and somewhere 10,800 okay just do it yeah now you can see we are expecting price will go up to all right and what we are exactly doing right now right now you can see price are running around 10,480 okay. we're gonna buy 10,500 in the money or at the money, all right. Okay, let me show you call option by um, 10,500 and we are hoping we just one month we have expires like that. Now it's look like that. When I bought this call option, you can say at the money where is current uh, price right now, and we are expecting within a month, within a month, price will go up to this level of 10,800, right? Three point above. So when we place, how do you look like that? Where one? Okay. How? Uh, look like that. Check it. All right. Now you can see this is the zero. So when we bought this call option, remember we are bullish market here uptrend. We are looking for buy. All right. So at that time we are applying this strategy. We bought here, and this is our maximum risk and maximum profit let me change the total amount of here and let me change right now just a minute i want to buy 75 lot size remember 75 lot size now what exactly they are showing here if price doesn't go to this level my maximum loss will be in the thousand it's a swing my maximum loss will be twenty thousand if price up to this level okay mm, let's see when price are going up it's a swing profit. all right it's a swing unlimited profit now i don't want to take so at that time what i'll do what i'll do now i will sell a call option to hedge my call option i do i'll do what is our target expecting price will go up to this level 10800 at that time we we are we will sell a call option of 10,800 that price will go up to this level 
and I will sell here call option this strike price. All right, and we we bought put option. All right, sorry, call option ten thousand five hundred strike price. Suppose this one at the money. Okay, and I sold ten thousand ten thousand eight hundred out of the money. Have you made sense? All right. How it should look like that. Now go to there and we need same expiry date. Yeah, remember expiration 30 July and change this target 10,800. Okay, now C 75. Now graphics look like that. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Graphics not look like that. Not call long. It is sold. All right, short. Remember, short. Ten thousand eight hundred. Uh, this ten thousand eight hundred we sold. Uh, this strike price, which we are expecting that price will go up to this level, and we bought ten thousand five hundred call option. Now see how it look like that. Okay. Now it's a graph is showing like that. Have you seen? Now when hedge it, it's just showing like if price doesn't go to this level, if we hold our position till expiry, not talking today, tomorrow, or that day, till expiry. When going to expire? 30 July. All right, if hold, if price goes below, we will we lost our money will be only 8,321 rupees. Otherwise, if price goes to this target, all right, 10,800, what is our profit? Our profit is showing 14,178 rupees. Have you seen it? How beautiful, all right. When we are applying this strategy, when market is very bullish, let me let me let me show you. All right, let me show you. See reliance. I already told you. See the reliance. All right. Okay. Now you can see here reliance is bouncing up, moving average 20, hit and reverse back, get a new high. Again, retrace toward moving average 20 and create a new now i'm focusing i already placed as put sell order that is the different trading strategy i already sold put sell order if price retrace i'll collect the premium i think 18000 on something whatever i'll get the money i'll buy in reliance and uh, i'll hold it all right i'll invest 18000 this is free money the free money all right I'm waiting to here to buy Reliance, but I can't buy here. I'm waiting to retrace the price. That is why I sold a put option. I'm just waiting. All right. When price will retrace and it is close above this area, I'll collect the premium, almost 18,000, and I'll invest this 18,000 in Reliance. All right. I think 100 share I'll get there. Okay. That is the difference. So now, what exactly I'm looking for here in the Reliance. Once Reliance retrace, once Reliance retrace to this level, I'll wait for a bullish confirmation, like parabolic shark are forming somewhere, parabolic shark are forming, stochastic already given by signal or X, Y, Z. In technical course, we are discussing what type of uh, confirmation we need once here all right here that type of candlestick pattern or confirmation what i'll do because i'm bullish this is a very strong company and currently they are running the uptrend and we are expecting price will goes up to one eight uh, zero zero all right and we are expecting price will retrace 
zero, zero. When price will drop to this level, what I'll do? I'll buy in the money or at the money. In the money, remember, don't in the money too far in the money. Just buy slight, slightly nearest in the money. Nearest in exactly at the money. I'll buy sixteen hundred at the money. After that, I'll sold. I'll sell call option eighteen hundred right price. All right. Okay. Let me read it. Yeah. Have you made sense? Have you got it? What I'm I'm explaining? Okay, will it be Junior market down? What to do? Market down. Okay, market down. Okay, wait, 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 wait. I'm explaining everything when we are playing. So can we sell call uh, call option in Reliance? Okay, eighteen hundred. No, 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 no. You can't, you can't do, you can't sell, you can't sell, you can't sell. You can't sell, that will be in the money. Don't do that, don't do that. And cut us, yeah, don't do that. What I'm doing, right? I think price will retrace. Now, most of the people are thinking, hey, price is dropping down. Let's sell it, let's sell it, all right? Sell means prices, uh, uh, price, when price will fell from that area will be profitable. No, don't do that. Don't do that. If price goes up, you have to bear unlimited losses. You have to, unlimited. You have to pay. All right, don't do that. That is a very wrong decision, Mr. Bankat. Very wrong decision. What I did, what I did, listen carefully. What I did, I when you sold it, right? Call option at the level of eighteen thousand means you are in in the money. Don't do that. There is intrinsic value in in the money. The expire. Remember, don't never become worthless. We are. Focusing when time will time will uh, uh, that option will expire at that time premium should less sense premium what that is why I sold what I sold put option what what is the put option. 1600 stack price are sold. I sold means when price will go up, I'll be profitable, right? Not exactly. We sold out of the money. We are not selling in the money. We are sold out of the money. We are using time decay. We are using time decay. Listen carefully, don't be complicated. Very interesting. If you don't know properly, it will destroy you. It's like an atom bomb. If you know how to use properly, you can generate power or accept accept. If you don't know exactly how to use, it will destroy you very dangerous. I'm telling you. If you know properly how to use, you can apply anywhere. All right. Atomic energy like that. All right. Okay. Okay. Now listen carefully. Why I sold this put option? Instead of I'm expecting price will drop, why I sold? I means I sold this strike price. I'm not expecting that price will cross that level. I'm not expecting why? Because by using technical analysis, remember why technical analysis is most important. By using technical analysis, we have seen price up bouncing from moving average, hit and bounce again from moving average, 
all right they are not able to break this level we are expecting price will retrace again it will bounce from that 20 moving average okay okay listen so that is why i sold it all right and i'm expecting within a 30 days price will stay in between this area not below not below all right not below remember and what premium i what premium right now running i will collect the all premium and all premium will be worthless all right it will be zero that is why i sold if price goes up i'll be profitable and price stay below uh, above this level in 1600 so i'll collect the all premium that's it only now listen what we are going suppose price drop to this level all right what i'll do exactly i'll buy all option i'll buy call strike price at the rate of 1600 and we are expecting price will go up to this level of 1800 all right after giving this retracement of correction or pullback whatever you say doesn't matter all right but main thing things is you have all right okay okay listen carefully listen carefully later i'll i'll take your questions all right listen carefully listen carefully don't don't do this mistake all right don't okay one mistake is very dangerous i'm telling you listen carefully and i will call option okay i'll sell call option strike price of 1800 once we uh okay all right well, indian stock market okay 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 uh, i'll i'll take every question one by one later all right first you can see so after that okay i'll buy call up from at the money and i'll sell uh call up once we uh, place both order it will be haze like that it will be haze like that all right it will be haze like that okay that is a zero line it is a maximum loss and this is the maximum profit and this is a upside and this is the downside it will be look like that so we are applying this strategy remember when we Applying different different trading strategy in different different market condition that is why i told first day in any direction if uh, any direction price goes money by using option but stock we can't do that we have only one direction if we buy price must go up if we sell price must go down in option any direction all right but you must know which strike price you have to buy and how to construct that uh, option strategy and most of the people are thinking hey let's go for here price is dropping and now again most of the people are thinking hey this is the overboard zone all right overboard zone price will drop from this area let's sell call option price will drop that is a big mistake we never know same same concept same direction two guy two guy two guys are option trader all right both are option and another guy is somewhere here he also option trader all right okay now two guys this guy think just he is just uh, uh just he is thinking that price will drop from this area from this level okay this guy also thinking that price will drop from this area now both direction are same both uh, analysis are same but they are applying option strategy differently this guy fell 
call option right this guy sell call option all right this guy sell call option all right and this guy sell put option have you seen their their views have you seen how they are constructing okay this guy sell this strike price strike price 1600 and this guy sold different strike price now which is most which one have winning high winning ratio this guy because very strong company trend is uptrend running uptrend it is a probability to reverse back again Does it make sense but this guy is doing very wrong decision why this is a very strong company running in an uptrend he is going against the trend but this guy is not going against the trend if price reverse back from this area this guy will this guy will die he will lose his maximum loss all right because this guy is going against the trend so that is why you must know what strategy you are going to apply remember listen carefully okay so that is why we are expecting it will retrace to this level. We will use call spread trading strategy. This strategy call call spread bull call spread trading strategy. Whatever trading strategy naming doesn't matter. You must know how to use that strategy. Let's see another stock. Is there is it there any? over so i can't uh, so exactly let's check it one by one some stocks is it they're running in an uptrend downtrend uh okay this is the buzzer screenings uh, okay this is overbought and the double no there is no trend score mm, they're running an uptrend they're bouncing from this area let's see in a four hour chart okay let's see for example we have seen a little more retracement in escort so let me show you here okay now uh suppose we have seen a score uptrend clear uptrend by using and they are creating higher high retrace is a higher high and a retrace so let's see we are expecting it will bounce from this area all right now right now price is running around 970 okay so let's see we are expecting price will go at least uh, somewhere here um, let's say 10 50 so we are expecting that price will go up to this level 10,050. So right now we're gonna apply this trading strategy. Let's see how it look like that. So let me use different strategy option builder. Okay, let's see here. Uh, okay, let me remove this one. Okay, this one, this one, this one up to this level. So we are hoping that price will go up. This is the in the money right now. Okay. Not exactly nifty. And what is uh, what was that? What was that? Escort. Let's check it. Escort. Okay. Escort. And we don't want a fusar. We need option and right now 25 zoom we are expecting that next month all right so we have uh, last only two days left right this expiry so we are going to buy uh, 30 32 days we have time 
price. So that is why we are buying 30 July. Now, what we are buying? Exactly, we are buying in the money or slightly in the money or at the money. Let's say, you know, that, uh, what is showing is 971. Mm, is it option price? Okay. Mm, 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 call option. Okay. Now see here how it look like that. Not exactly. I don't think so here. Let me let me check it. Why is it coming like that? Add the money, no. Seventy-one modify. I can apply this. All right, let's check it another thing. Thirty July and one zero five zero. It's a uh, note that I saw swing. Okay, it's okay. Let's see. Let's see you somewhere here. And use somewhere here. All right. What is the escort? Okay. All right. Wait, 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 wait. Okay. Why is it not founding here? Escort. What happened, escort? Don't have. Let's check it. Escort, escort. Don't have escort. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Maybe the escort. I think don't have escort. Let's check it different stocks. Maybe it about escort. Ah. SCM pain, no. No, we need clear up then. All right, now it's over. You know. Report no, I'm about okay. Sixty six no. Let's check it early. All right, exactly how we are applying when we are applying. So otherwise, we uh, will uh, in a wrong place. All right, we will buy some way other. Let's check it. Let's check it. Is it there? S and pin no. Okay, it's gone up. We need a retracement. So every stock goes. So that is why, okay, it's already gone. All right. And I, I want to show you exactly when we are in our uptrend. So everything is running in the upside. Okay, 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 okay. It's gone up. We don't need one on that type of stocks. But uh, no. The merger gone up. Clear up then, clear up then. And then after that, replacement we need. Okay. All right. So I think someone gone already gone in for body RTL. Let me see the stock, which is retrace given retrace. Retracement. Okay, let's check it. Let's check it. Okay. Option. I don't think so. It's an option. Okay. What is that? Chemical petrol. Let's call that. Okay. Already retraced. And clear up. Then. Where is the Okay, already gone, gone. Yeah, like it would. We need a retracement, gone everything. Exiting here. Exit. Sun for.
already gone. We need a retracement stock. So where I can apply, All right? So I'm looking for that type of stock. Clear up then after that uh, retracement. All right, let's the bank on. Is this life gone up? So, no stock. Yeah, very unlucky. I don't know what. Yeah, I'm gonna. It's downtrend. Okay, we can we can in the scene bank. It's also gone up. Let me see it one by one. I think I don't think so. Yeah. All right. Is it there? Uh, Hindustan Zinc. Is it there in option? I don't know about option. Hindustan Zinc. Is it there? Hindustan Zinc. Yes, I can. No, yeah. Let's check in different st other stocks. We have seen this one, so we can construct this one, right? Clearly downtrend. And we can apply this strategy like that. Yeah, and we are expecting that will create. So we can apply this uh, strategy, but I don't think so here. So, yeah, no option is showing. That is why I'm not able to construct. Let me say definitely we'll get one. All right, so don't worry. In this market, we need patience. All right, all right, I see. I'll, okay, I'll leave it. Go. What in the, okay. In the scene. Okay, 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 in the scene. All right, uh, by the way, this is the in the scene bank. So suppose I've seen price are running in a downtrend. Sorry. And we are hoping, yeah, okay, okay, let's see this one. All right, this is the Indusin Bank, so I, right, yeah, it will be good. Let's check it. Uh, this one, Indusin Bank, right now running 524. Let's, okay, yeah, Indusin Bank, this one, yeah. Okay, cool, cool. Now, oh. from where here, we took two option price first. What we'll do? Okay, listen. So, uh, by using this um, moving average, we have seen price hit and reverse back toward this moving average 20. And they create and retrace toward this moving average 20. So we are expecting price will hit this level somewhere here. So let me draw a connect. We are expecting within 30 days price will go let's say 575. All right. Right now price is uh, 524. Okay, let's check it. Let's check it here. So, what we'll do, uh, we'll construct this strategy. First, we have to money. What is the running? 24. Let's check it. 24 and 10 and 24 into buy slightly in the money. Right? And right now, price is 24. We'll buy 20. That is a in the money. All right. Next, we're going to sell it. Remember, we're going to sell it. All right. Which is our target is showing 575. Let's check it. What is the strike price are available? Five near 575. 570 exactly are there. 570. All right. There are no strike price. 570. That is why we select the strike price 570. Let's uh, expire now today, the 5th zone, and we can't buy this 5th zone because it is too near. All right, we have to expire. So that is why we just select 30 plus 2, 30, 32 days. 30 July, same July. All right, let's go. Yeah. Okay. 
see how graph is look like that. See? Okay. Now this line is showing us profit and loss. If price doesn't go, uh, all right, that level, if price stay below this level, so what, what is our maximum loss? It's just showing uh, 20 rupees per, it's a depend on how many, uh, uh, right? So I didn't check it, you just check yourself, all right? And the profit is showing 20, all right? One is two, uh, 1.9, something like, all right? But we never hold our position till expiry. If price doesn't go to this level, we never goes. What we'll do? If price retrace back again, if they break 20 moving ever, so we'll uh, lose our entire money. We never hold. If price goes against us, we'll close up. lot of a little more money all right okay those will earn enough money so that is why we are constructing so let's get from so you can see actually actual so let's see here uh what was that what is that In okay nice here in the scene bank okay let me remove and you can have interesting uh, interesting uh, and you can you can analyze yourself so we are selecting option uh, this one and future we are select and just select expiry date 30 july and option price we're gonna buy what we act actually what we bought which one? Five. Bought. Five twenty. Let's buy. Yeah. Buy here. Five. Five twenty. Okay. This one. Now you just. Take. Okay. See how it look like that. All right. It look like that. Now we, what are we gonna? Do? What? Now. Same option expiry date, but strike different. What is the strike price? 570. Am I right? Five. All option both are there. And you can check here IB percentile, option chain, delta, gamma, y, z, whatever you want. All right. How would you look like that? And now this place platform are a little more different all right let's check this platform and this platform in this plate in this platform we have seen two lines here we have seen one uh, this line and this line is the same this line uh, this one uh, which one uh, right line i'm talking about this line this line are uh, calculating till expiry all right when Price will expire their their and this line. All right, that is why I'm using this uh, plate. And this dot dot line profit and loss every day's profit and okay. Now again, the price goes up. What is the profit? What is the loss? What is the profit? Everything is showing by this. Online, all right, and this line is showing till ex during expiry date. So you can apply this. So right now here you can see, and here you can see if price goes to this level, um, okay. Now here you can see if price goes to this level, it's just showing maximum profit twenty three thousand seven hundred twenty. Doesn't go to this level at certain level which we are expecting this level. It doesn't go if price we hold our position. What is 
is our expiry date? 30. 30 July. All right, 30 July, this one, last. All right. Okay. Our maximum loss will be 16,000. Remember, we never hold the expiry. Okay, because of time decay. Time, time decay for buyer time decay is very dangerous. For seller, time decay is God. All right. So now we are constructing what the as a buyer. We are not using as a seller. We are using as a buyer. That is why is very dangerous for us. So if price doesn't go, well, if stay in this area, uh, some indicator will tell us no. We and we can't run to this level. So what we'll do, we'll, we'll close our position by loss. Sorry, losing only 2,000, 3,000, whatever at that time. All right, 10,000, if we hold our position. All right, all right, okay. Right, interesting bank. Okay, let me read. Okay, interesting bank. Uh, but uh, it is not a future. Okay, yeah, it's in Dallas still. Okay, no. Or in this 520. Yeah, okay. Uh, probability is very low, sir. Okay. Very low. Leave it. All right. Focusing on very uh, high. For example, I'm telling you, example, in the same bank, we everybody knows very weak company, we bank. But for, for understanding, I'm at type of pattern. So rest of the other, other stock are over both zone, we can construct that straight. In the same bank, we have seen this opportunity. But I never trade. All right, I'm focusing on Momentum stocks, high momentum stock. What is the high? I already explained in my course high momentum stock is uh, like who have more than uh, more than 15% and uh, more than uh, 2 lakh share traded. All right, clearly uptrend, fundamentally strong. Depth. All right. Using this one because there are more than thousand and thousand stocks are there. So some selected stock are and remember every day I'm trading, every time I'm, I have position, like I have position in Reliance. All right, I never close my position. In, I'm changing, but I'm changing different different trading strategy. I already I'm using different different trading strategies, but remember. Every, every time I have position in Reliance in Asian Paint, a bank Nifty or Nifty, I have positions. Okay. All right. Okay. Nice. Uh, if it comes, okay, it comes down. Uh, if price goes down, so I'll close our position. All right. Definitely we'll close. If price Nickel tell us. No, we don't have momentum. We don't have strength. We can't run to this level. All right. So many tell us. All right. Many indications uh, like and uh, short term candlestick pattern, parabolic are stochastic or MSCD. Everybody will tell us, hey, Google, uh, we never goes up to this level. We are ready to run to our downside. Definitely, yeah, bro. I'll close that everything. Not greedy. I don't want to. If I'm wrong, I'll close my position. But my loss is very minimum. Okay. How many do you rotate at, at that time? Okay. There is very interesting question. Do you think uh, uh, we need huge amount of? No, no. 
we don't need that mass of money. First, uh, but when we are haze this position, uh, I haze in um, what call this one? Reliance, I use, I think, for 36,000. only. If I sold it only, naked, we need more than, not exactly, sorry, uh, in nifty, nifty, nifty. Right. We need more, but when we hedge it, uh, we are using hardly below 50,000, below 50,000. 50, Let me go that. Okay. Just revise once. Okay, sure, sure. Please explain briefly again. Uh, whatever this one. Can we trade weekly expiry? Nick? Yeah, yeah, every year. Weekly expiry. We're doing every Thursday. We are, we are, we are Thursday. We just collect the premium every Thursday. Nifty and Bank Nifty both. I'm collecting. All right. Very interesting. Okay, very interesting. I'm telling. Okay, so let's see in Nitty and Bang Nitty. Nitty, suppose this is the Bang Nitty. All right. So this is the market rings, and at the time, so some somewhere here. Yeah. All right. So I hate in this market. Last trust every trust. I hate the market. If Bishop, uh, which broker platform do you use for trading? Okay, Mr. Dilly, you can apply anywhere. Anywhere. Uh, this is not giving by rule of, uh, this is NHC rule. They reduce our margin. They reduce our margin. When you the market, you apply like naked or something like that. Or day trading, you can you you can. Advance. I'm buying for uh, like a long of very day, like thirty two days, forty days, fifty days, like that. So when we are using that expiration, so we need very less margin. So you check it in your broker. All right. take advantage of margin what to do either it's a short or buy yeah very interesting question mr Mark. exactly i'm doing that thing all right suppose i want to buy in uh, i want in nifty sell call sell okay i'm gonna go for sell direction if you wanna sell it first you need huge amount all right and if you wanna buy so definitely you need huge amount of money so in that case you just buy fast all right small like first so after that you say okay after that you sell it all right don't place buy a uh, sell order first place buy order first okay. and i see i see i see i see reducing their margin no. Okay, no, 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 no. Definitely they'll give, they'll give. Uh, Mr. Dilip, they'll give it. I'm not talking for you. Talking about a weekly option. You just uh, select far expiration date. All right, far expiration. Like uh, today's 23rd, you just try to buy like July. All right, 30 July. All right, 30 July stack price. Then you see, then you see, then you tell me. So. It is not Boca rule, it is NSC rule. All right, they reduce their margin. Can we buy call, uh, uh, buy a call instead of future in bouncing method in today? Yeah, definitely. Yeah, Jason, yeah, definitely we can we, we can do that. Because I'm doing, I, I never did. I, I'm really, I'm doing futures. I always use option because option uh, because we are we are we are giving a premium. We have time decay. We are applying when we are buying. We are selling something at that time. Time decay to collect the premium. See, I'm focusing on sell direction. I'm focusing on sell direction only. When market is extremely bullish. High momentum at the time I goes 
in a bi direction not means like uh, not like i'm buying only naked buy i never become a naked buy at that time right i hate it but my focus on buy direction. most of the time i i'm focusing only which software are you using for chart analysis? This is MT4, MT4, uh, Metadata 4, all right? I'm using this one, uh, you, it, it is available in Allies Blue. Yeah, in weekly X-ray, can you show the Nifty and Bank Nifty? Okay, 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 sure, sure. That Tuesday. Okay, Wednesday. Okay, tomorrow we're gonna discuss this one. So you're gonna apply strategy uh thursday all right nice okay please revise the uh, slide uh okay nice slightly all right let's let's see let's uh, to this uh, uh in the sin bank because we have seen they are running uh that way that is why i'm explaining because told i never trade in here all right, I trade some high momentum stocks only. All right. And now let's see here. Let me read again. What is what is the meaning of there? Actually, you just learn first. All right, learn first. So let me explain somewhere here. Whiteboard. Okay, now yeah. So suppose we have seen uh, somewhere the press is running like that this is ma or ema or xyz the we are applying bouncing trading strategy at that time so let me change the okay this is the price price are uh, bouncing of moving average so say uh 50 ma for example all right so in price hit and regards back create a new high Again, again, create a new high. All right, we have seen this, uh, this uh, stock is running clearly uptrend. And let's say this one, moving average. All right, by using moving average, we have seen this trend is very clear trend. 150 above 200 and 50 above 150. Here uptrend right now. Now you can see price are bouncing up, and now we have decrease of moving average 50, and exactly price is somewhere right now. This stock price is 100. All right, all right, stock price is 100. And we have seen some candlestick pattern in this area. So let's see, this is a dozy pattern are forming right now. Okay. Now we call this market behavior, price of moving average 50, 50, and right now price near. And now what we are thinking? We are thinking that price will again bounce this moving average and at least price will hit this resistance line. This is the risk. Let me see. Uh, okay. Okay. We are expecting price will hit this resistance line. Means price will goes up to this resistance line. Now, this resistance line, suppose um, 100, uh, 120, sorry, 120, yeah, expecting from 100, price will go up to 20, we are expecting price will go up to 20 rupees within a month. All right. So in that case, what we are doing buy will buy this strike price, which is strike price 
this is 100 and it may be at the money or in the money all right slightly in at right is at the money stack price or slightly in the money so let's see at stack price is 100 all right okay now what we'll do we'll buy at the money call option right at the money call option okay so once we buy call option our look like that our graph like that okay and they are running like that they are running like that means that profit uh, sorry limited loss limited profit it's just showing like that we never know so right now when we buy any stock of or sell, uh, put option time decay is very dangerous for us every day uh, premium will decrease because of time. what who are telling us theta will tell I already explained. That is why we are focusing on theta every day, how many rupees they are going to from our premium. Okay. So to apply this theta, what we are doing now? All right. Now we never know how many days, 20 days or 15 days, 25 days, whatever. But if we hold our position every day we have to pay uh, that is called theta theta will deduct our money from our our premium to util time so what we will do we will sell Our target strike price. What is our target? Target 120. We are expecting price will go up to this level. So we will get this strike price. L120 strike price. Once this strike price, 120 strike. So what happened? Our graph will be look like that. All right. Our sorry, let's see. Our graph will look like that. Okay. Uh, just a week. All right. Our graph will. Okay. All right. Okay. Our graph will look like that. Okay. Now you can see it hates the market. This cell will collect our collect the premium all right this call we paid the premium so once we place both call and graph will be this is maximum loss this is the zero level this is the minus maximum loss and this is the profit okay that is the basic momentum so remember criteria what criteria need number one criteria Price should be up trend or down trend. For in down trend, we will use opposite. All right. All right. We are looking for clear up trend. So who will tell us that up trend or down trend? Moving averages will tell us that it is a clear and clear down trend. Now, second, what criteria? The price should bounce off specific moving averages. Now, in this area, we have seen price are bouncing off moving average 50. Number right. Number three, we need a bullish system. It may be pattern. Parabolic circle, whatever. Once they above 
this moving average will apply this pairing strategy. Is it clear? Is it clear? There. Okay. Okay. Every day take like keep it some white. Okay. Okay. Sell or sell call, sell call, not put call. Sell call by sell call. All right. Strike price is the same strike price. The topic you tell 10 days holding tech to expiry contact with its stock are contact because of the monthly expiry. Hmm. So yesterday, no, no, uh, 10 days. So that, that is a indices. Indices have, every, indices are expiring every Thursday, every Thursday. But it stop expiring every last of this month. Uh, Mr. Rajesh, uh, test we are applying different, different expiry dates, but remember, we have to select one expiry date because they don't have every, every week expiry date. Good night. Today is excellent. Okay, nice. Thanks. Enough today. Yeah, enough, enough. Yeah, even I'm trying um, hard uh, from 7 a.m. I'm working continuously because, uh, yeah, I'm focusing to make perfect. That is my key for me because I have less time. Really, I'm telling you, I have very less. Please, not okay. Presentation, presentation. Yeah, I'm not creating. I'm explaining again a lack of uh, the time. I'm not able to create presentation. And uh, definitely, I'll create a course in my YouTube and I'll upload that will be basic option trading course. That will be free. And another rest of the I'll be. I, I'm going to okay, this one, what called. Okay, who people want to buy because uh, because of some uh, uh, payment gateway because it's not working properly. So that is why I'm not sending anything. For I'm sorry, X team. Uh, I told you that I'm going to give it technical course. All right. So payment gateway is not working properly. So that is why I manually I account number you can you can okay you can transfer it. All right. So definitely, uh, I thought uh, I go, I'm going to uh, release that gateway, but it's not working properly. Some yeah Google Pay. Sure, sure. Definitely, I'll I'll send. All right. So I sure today or tonight. I'll so let I'm able to create this one properly. This uh, payment gateway. So I'll inform you, or otherwise tonight around. Uh, okay, tonight I'll send everything. Okay, sure. Thanks. And so I hope how we trade in the option. Uh, so tomorrow we'll discuss different trading strategy. Uh, All right, so tomorrow we'll discuss different trading uh, of some trading history. All right, thanks. Good time.